The manufacturing process for a steel lunchbox involves several steps, from raw material preparation to final assembly. Here's an overview. 1. Material selection and preparation. Raw materials. High-quality stainless steel is commonly used for lunchboxes due to its durability, corrosion resistance, and food safety. Sheet metal procurement. Stainless steel sheets of specific grades, like 304 or 316, are procured. Cutting. Sheets are cut into the desired size using laser cutting, shearing, or punching machines. 2. Shaping and forming. Deep drawing. A hydraulic or mechanical press is used to shape the steel sheet into the base and lid of the lunchbox. This process ensures the steel retains its strength while forming the required shape. Trimming. Excess material is trimmed to refine the edges. Rolling or beading. The edges of the box are rolled or beaded to prevent sharp edges and improve safety. 3. Welding and joining spot. Welding. Components like hinges, clasps, or compartments are joined using spot welding. Brazing or seam welding. Ensures a leak-proof connection in multi-compartment lunchboxes. 4. Surface finishing polishing. The steel surface is polished to achieve a smooth finish. Mirror or matte finishes are common. Electroplating, if required. To enhance corrosion resistance or provide aesthetic finishes. Surface coating. Some lunchboxes may receive a non-toxic coating or insulation layer. Fifth assembly fitting. Hinges, clasps, gaskets, and partitions are installed. Handle attachment. If the lunchbox includes a handle, it is affixed using screws or rivets. Testing. The box is checked for proper sealing, durability, and alignment. 6. Quality control leak. Testing. Multi-compartment boxes are tested for leaks. Durability testing checks for strength, hinge operation, and resistance to impacts. Food safe compliance ensures no harmful residues remain after production. 7. Labeling and packaging branding. Logos or instructions are engraved, embossed, or printed. Packaging. The finished product is packed using eco-friendly or protective materials to avoid damage during transport. 8. Distribution products are stored, shipped, and distributed to retailers or end consumers. This process may vary slightly depending on the design, complexity, and additional features of the steel lunchbox.